Good. The family of a 25 year old tri state man who was stabbed to death early this week is talking tonight about how they want him to be remembered. Our Simone Jameson sat down with the family and joins us with a story you will only see right here on Fox 19 Now. Rob, 46 year old Billy Ray Morton, is being held at the Hamilton County Jail, charged with the deadly stabbing that claimed the life of 25 year old Terry Claiborne. The so loss Claiborne's loved ones tells me leaves them both heavy hearted and filled with rage. He was a good kid. He was still young. He had his whole life is still ahead of him. It's a loss. The family of 25 year old Terry Claiborne says it's too painful to put into words. Remembering him as a man who loved cracking jokes, playing video games, and cared deeply for his family and friends. He had a very big heart. Yeah. All he wanted was to be around friends and people that cared about him. They all loved him and, and miss him very, very, very much. He'll yeah, never be forgotten. Police say the suspect, 46-year-old Billy Ray Morton, stabbed Terry multiple times during a physical altercation on Bryson Street near Kenwood Avenue in Cincinnati's California neighborhood around 645 Wednesday morning. Terry was pronounced dead at UC Medical Center. I didn't leave his side. It hurts because um, I watched my baby take his last breath. He wasn't a fighter, he was a lover. Police say they arrested Morton nearly 12 hours after finding Terry. While Terry's family tells me they are grateful, Morton is behind bars. They say it brings them little comfort as they grieve the tremendous loss. That's my child he took for me. I don't ever want him to be released. I hope the guilt consumes him that he took a kid's life. I mean, he was barely 25. Terry's family tells me they are neither emotionally nor financially prepared to deal with his death, leading on all the support they can get to give Terry the memorial he deserves. He always liked to drive and go different places. He never was one to just, just sit around. He was loved very much. Very much by, by so many people. It's just not fair at all. No. He didn't deserve this. He deserves to be celebrated and remembered. Morton is being held on a $150,000 bond in connection with Terry's murder. The Claiborne family tells me they're hopeful of finalizing funeral services for Terry here at Gilligan Funeral Home within the next couple of days. They also tell me they're planning to host a balloon release forum. Live in Kenwood, Simone Jameson, Fox 19 Now. It is an